what is a process flow chart process flow chart is the pictorial presentation of the actual process it is a chart showcasing the flow of the product or service in an actual process standard symbols showcase the different activities of the process connecting by means of arrows on a process flow chart what are the standard symbols using which one can design a process flow chart there are five standard symbols using which you can design a process flow chart rounded rectangle uses to showcase the start and end point of the process rectangle uses to showcase an operation or an activity on the product or service diamond uses to showcase a decision or a condition like accept or reject the product d like shape uses to showcase the delay in the process when the product or service has to wait unnecessarily for its next stage of operation and inverted triangle uses to showcase the storage area in the process why does the process flow chart use as a qc tool process flow chart is the bird's eye view of the actual process it gives an idea how do the inputs like raw material data or information converting into an output in form of a product or a service it helps in improving the work efficiency of the process it helps in reducing the cycle time of the process it helps in auditing the whole process and tracking the trouble spots it helps in providing training to newcomers to work on the process and it helps in identifying the value added and non value added activities in the process what are the value added and non value added activities an activity that makes a physical change or added value to the product like packing sealing labeling etc is known as value added activity an activity that makes no physical change or added no value to the product like accounting inspection counting etc is known as non value added activity these activities increase the cycle time of the process hence required as minimum as possible to improve the process efficiency by reducing the cycle time look at the quality inspection process the process starts with 100% inspection okay parts accepted and sent for packing and defective parts rejected and sent to scrap house after packing box is collect for final inspection at final inspection if acceptance quality level is found okay then the lot is forwarded to warehouse and if aql is not found okay then the lot sends for reshorting at reshorting after 100% inspection of the lot received okay parts sent for packing again and defective parts sent to scrap house from warehouse box is sent for pre dispatch inspection if pdi is not found okay then box is sent back to warehouse for correction and if pdi is found okay then box is moved to loading and the inspection process completes here this with a process flow chart gives the bird's eye view of the whole process and helps in auditing the process you can remove the unnecessary activities if you think it will improve the process efficiency and reduce the cycle time of the process